What up peeps? Welcome to today's vlog. I got to the store pretty late today and normally I'd probably go to the outlet and then come in late, but I was just sleeping. <laughs> I don't know what it was. I was just really tired. I still feel really tired. Um, didn't stay up that late last night, no later than usual, but ended up sleeping like another three or four hours than I normally would. <laughs> And I'm still tired, but um, had to come in and get some stuff done. Uh, so we do have a couple trade-ins so far from this morning. Let's take a look at them. These are in no particular order. So we have a Pokemon Sapphire. We have a, I think it's a Metallic Pink um, DS Lite. Aggressive Inline for PS2. Oh, I guess two copies. <laughs> Pokemon Ultra Moon. Ape Escape with no manual. Uh, ATV Offered Fury 2. Starsky and Hutch. Madden 08. NHL 06. NASCAR 07, uh, World, World Soccer International winning 11-8, and then Final Fantasy Anthology, Masters, Tiger Woods, and then a sealed Starlink Battle for Atlas for the Xbox One. So this is everything so far. Um, it seems like it's kind of slow today. Uh, just a couple customers in here when I got here, so we probably won't have too many trades to go over today, but at least this stuff so far. It has finally happened, guys. I am starting a new Amazon shipment. I have literally not sent in anything to sell on Amazon since August, or no, since February of 2018. That was before we opened the store. Uh, I sent my last shipment in before we, before we kind of like started the process of looking for a building. And then once that kind of started, that's all I did. And I've just been focusing on the store ever since, but I've been wanting to do Amazon again because there's a lot of stuff that sells on Amazon that doesn't sell on eBay or it sells for more on Amazon, or it sells better on Amazon. So, as you guys might or might not know, I was a full-time eBay and Amazon seller from 2014 until we opened the store. I did it full-time. So, um, I have a bunch of stuff I've been buying for Amazon over, <laughs> over the past few years that's kind of just been building up. And it's not like I have a ton, you know, when I was doing it full-time, I would get I would get multiple things every single day. and But now I've just got like a bunch of sealed board games. I've got sealed puzzles. I've got some sealed packs of like blank DVDs and stuff like that. Um, and then some pre-owned items as well that are, gonna, that are gonna be going in. A lot of people have been requesting maybe like a, in addition to the what I sold on eBay videos, maybe like a what sold on Amazon type of video. The only problem with that is that I can't physically show you any of the stuff because I send everything to the Amazon warehouses and then when they ship, or when they sell, Amazon workers pull and ship the items because I do FBA, which is fulfillment by Amazon. So once I send out my packages with all the stuff in it to Amazon, my work is done and I just collect money at that point when items sell. So I can't really show you guys what sold unless you just want to see like a text list, which wouldn't be that fun. So I think we're just going to continue with the what, what sold on eBay videos. Um, and they're going to get bigger and better and, and longer and stuff, the, you know, the more I have listed. Um, people have been asking to see like a what sold on our website type of video as well. And we sell so much on our website. You'd be looking at, I mean, unless I literally just like went this game, this game, this game. If I tried to talk about stuff, you'd be looking at an hour video every single day. And that's not going to work. So I think we're just going to stick with the what sold on eBay. Um, and then also for anyone who has sent in a resurfacing order, I'm almost done with them all. So I've already sent out one invoice. Um, we have two orders being resurfaced right now. And uh, I have the machine paused while I'm talking, of course, because it's super loud. But I just want to let you guys know that I am doing an Amazon shipment. So far, I have these four items. I don't know if you can see them. And then I have a couple puzzles here I'm going to enter. And I've got a bunch of other stuff. Um, so far, on these four, there's a there's three games and a, and a CD. Um, so far, we are at $65 after fees. So that's not too bad. It's only four items. The total sales value is 100 so fees on Amazon are really high. But 100 it's $99.95, and then I get $65.05 after fees. Um, that's not taking into account the shipping cost and the buy cost of the items, but the buy cost on these, these all have Goodwill stickers on them still. Like the CD was like two ninety nine, I think the games were like three ninety nine, four ninety nine. So it's not that much, and shipping is not that much either. When you ship a giant box, you get a discounted rate through UPS with Amazon. So it's really cheap. You can ship like a forty pound box for like fifteen dollars, which 
that's incredibly cheap. You'd never be able to ship something that cheap if you went to the UPS store and tried to ship it. So I'm gonna get back to work. Uh, we actually close in about 40 minutes or so. We do have some more trade-ins to look at, which we'll probably take a look at later. Um, and then we have, you can't really see it, but this is that Dance Dance Revolution pad that, um, that Naven found at the outlet. And he is not an eBay seller, and that's really gonna be the best place to sell that. So he is, so I'm gonna be listing it on my eBay for him, and then once it sells, we're just gonna be splitting the money. Uh, I think he offered to give me 33%, which is cool. I'll be the one shipping it as well. Um, but he wants to learn how to do it, so I'm gonna show him how to list it on eBay. So. Um, we're gonna be doing that right as we close. I'm gonna try to film a little bit with him and then try to film a little bit with Ryan and stuff before they leave uh, because yesterday I didn't really get a chance to and I don't want there to be two videos in a row where it's just me. Yeah. What we get? You guys wanna see what Abby got us? Oh, I remember these. Abby yeah. got Ryan a sticker. Isn't that cool? Beep's butt butthead sticker. Got it from Canyonville, Oregon. Freaking awesome. Tiny, tiny town. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no that's what I needed. I have the pink one in the package that I got. Also got from Abby. Mm -hmm. But she got me these guys. Hell yeah! Mm -hmm. Awesome. Super yeah, they're cute. so cute. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Love them. He got something too. Ryan's what you get? Didn't get something. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Abby got a bunch of stuff oh, on her oh. trip, and we didn't show it. Uh, yeah. Well, a lot of it's in the back. Half of it's in the back. We can show it today. Okay. All right. So we got this double-sided nice. trip poster. Curb stomping, whatever that is. <laughs> That is very cool. Yeah. cool. Yeah. yeah. Navin Looks really like it's from a strategy guy. Was just like, can I have this? <laughs> like, really quickly. And I was just like, yeah, sure. And then Ryan's just like, ah. Oh! I was highly disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> and just like oh, this cool. Godzilla Unleashed poster for like, was it PS2 and Wii game? Thank you. That is cool. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. yeah that's cool. You were actually really... dissing on it earlier. So yeah. you don't think it's cool. No, the other one's a lot cooler. The Metroid one. <laughs> <laughs> They're both cool, but the Metroid one's way cooler. Yeah, that's true. But this isn't a bumper sticker. It's a notebook sticker. For your binder. Just to correct all you guys out. Put it on your bumper anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Before you guys try to correct us. <laughs> <laughs> we have a couple more of these, though. Mm -hmm. You put them in the system? Not yet. Okay. We will have them in the system, though. It'll be in the toy category. Well, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Pretty cheap. What year is it? 1993. Mm. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Only three years away from being as old as us. <laughs> <laughs> How many years away from Naven? <laughs> <laughs> Too many. Born. <laughs> <laughs> like 20 or something. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> Naven is the baby. Yeah, 19. Naven's 19. <laughs> God. I well, popped out the womb and just started working. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. That's a good one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's weird not being the youngest, but. We had something the other day that was like from like 2001, and I was like, I was like, oh, this is older than Naven. <laughs> <laughs> oh my It seems God. so weird that's, to think. That's he was older than me. <laughs> yeah, that's super weird. That is weird. Holy crap. <laughs> <laughs> the PS2 is older than Naven. What the heck? <laughs> there's there's <laughs> times where I, I ask Maven and I'm just like, I'm like, I'll ask him, I'm like, do you know about this? Because like, I really genuinely don't know if you're taught about it because there's a lot of things that I feel like um, probably ended right around like my generation or well, not my, my like maybe my age group um, that are no longer taught in school because maybe it's just a little bit more taboo now than it was. Mm. Um, and I think we were all taught about it, but I'm just like, do they teach that anymore in yeah. school? Most of the time. I can, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. But when like any of these geezers talk about stuff. <laughs> 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 um, but then there's also like movies that I'm just like, have you, have you watched this? Because even the movies are a little bit before my time. So like Shawshank Redemption, like I've asked him if he watched it and he was like, no, I haven't seen it. And I'm just like, you should, it's a classic. And then I'm just like, man, I so know. <laughs> but it's good. I mean. I want to. You should. I'm I don't like take time to watch a lot of movies. 
Same with yeah, me either. either. Yeah, yeah I, I, bring, I brought out a quote from Little Nicky today, and they didn't, neither of them okay, knew. I neither watched them. Little Nicky in, like, <laughs> fifth grade, and I watched it one time, and that was it. So I have an excuse. I watched it once, too. I didn't like it. Oh. I actually thought it was kind of it's good. <laughs> it's, <funny. laughs> it's good. I don't like most of his movies, though. So. That's hard. That's hard. I think a lot of people don't like most of his movies. Most of his movies aren't really that good. <laughs> <laughs> when, but there are a when few you, gems. You were talking yeah. about that quote. You were just like, oh, it's from an Adam Sandler movie. And I was just like, Waterboy? Because <laughs> I forget that he was in Little Nicky all the time. I think, like, yeah. I can't name an Adam Sandler movie that I've watched except for what about Mr. Deeds? Nope. Oh. <laughs> no, you want to watch like Billy Madison, Happy Gilmore. Mm. Mm. I've seen part of Happy Gilmore. 51st Dates. 51st okay, Dates. That, that is amazing. <laughs> I've seen that one. Click is okay. It has a Click's sad really ending. Bad. It has a sad ending. I like it, but I guess, yeah, I got sad. Yeah, I, I, like thought, so I, I thought I thought Click and bad. Mr. Deeds were his two best movies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, Mr. Deeds was all right, uh, but I would rather watch. Um, I like when he he that? has the fountain and he's like when he has the kid Hawaiian punch. Um, <laughs> oh yeah 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 when he had like he somehow ends up with a kid. And yeah. it's like is it his? It's yeah. It's, uh, it's what is that kid. called? Yeah, I can't remember. Big Daddy. I yeah. think so. Yeah, I think yeah. Nice. yeah. I think he's so. like peeing yeah. in the tree. <laughs> Love that. Oh man, that kid is so awesome. <laughs> They're like, say, say Tupac. <laughs> <laughs> isn't that oh, man, the so two good. guys from? Uh, isn't that like like the Sweet Life of Zach and Cody? Isn't it? Wasn't that the kid who did that? It, it's a set of twins. Oh yeah. I have no idea. I think he might be right. I don't know. But that kid was funny. Yeah, I liked it when he spit and like. Touch the ground with a spit and suck it back up. <laughs> so Dylan and Cole Strauss. <laughs> Dylan and Cole Strauss are two twins, and they one of them was in that because mm. like they were also in Friends for mm. a little bit. Mm. Well, you ready to learn about some eBay stuff? Yes, I'm definitely ready to learn about some eBay stuff. Okay. Yes. You guys leaving? Yeah. Okay. Bye. We'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> All right. Hi everybody. Um, I don't know what Cooper last filmed. I'm assuming like a trade-in, I don't know, or all of us talking. Um, so I went on my weekend to go visit my really close good friend Jackie and also her dog Pip, who's amazing. He's a good boy. I wish you got to meet him because he's such a good dog. Anyways, um, Jackie and John and her boyfriend both collect. They went on our trip to Arizona with us. Um, but John also works at a video game store, and I happened to pick some stuff up directly from John. Um, so, these are my goodies from the trip. Um, some of them have already been processed, which was a good amount of handheld consoles that Cooper's going to show now. So there's a couple of Game Boy Advances. We have some Game Boy Pockets, some Game Boy Colors, including that awesome Pokemon one. Bunch of those. Then there's actually one more Game Boy Color right down there it just didn't fit up here but yeah lots of them this is awesome because we definitely need them um so the rest of the stuff is in here there i think there's exciting stuff um first we have a sealed link from link's awakening we have a sealed banjo and kazooie i also got an open banjo kazooie for myself um and then we have blue dsi with the charger Actually, I don't think this is the right charger. It's a DS Lite. This is a, oh yeah, a DS Lite with a DSi charger. These are DSi's, blue and black. White one. And then we have a uh, Wolf Link Amiibo. Didn't we just sell one of those? Yes, for way too cheap. So whoever got that got a great deal. <laughs> um, we have a Link's Awakening Link. I thought I needed that one, but I already have him open. And we have a Rider, Link Rider Amiibo. Um, I got this from a Goodwill. Um, it was half off of this price, so it was $15. There's no charger, but it looks to be in good condition and we can always have, you know, use a spare dock. And then... It's a Nintendo Switch dock for anyone who couldn't tell. Oh, yeah. Sorry. It's got that thing on there. But yeah, it was 15 bucks. Yes. 
Um, I went to an antique store and I actually picked up these two. Ryan got one of them, you saw that earlier. And then I got these for free. <laughs> um, and then back to the stuff I got from John, we have a Vita. This is a 1000 model. Um, Pokemon Crystal he told me to pick the nicest one. He had three of them and I wanted all of them. <laughs> And then we have I don't know what this goes to, but it's a Nintendo It's a Switch cable. Okay. It's a short one. Um North American Gold System with an expansion pack with the matching controller. Awesome. Expansion pack will be separated from it, maybe, most yeah. likely. We usually always separate the expansion packs. We have jumper packs to put in the consoles. Um, there are three items currently missing. We have a Def Jam Fight for New York disc only for PS2. We have Galarians for PS1. It has the artwork for the front and back, but the, the binding, the side stuff is torn off because it's a three disc game and it's missing the manual. We have a Sui Coden 2 that's disc only for PS1. And then we have a Silent Hill 3 for PS2 with the soundtrack that's also disc only. Um, we had a black PSP and a blue PSP, but we sold the black one already. And then we have two Pokeballs and a Pokewalker. We have a Zelda Wiimote. Awesome. He like didn't know if he wanted to sell this because he's like, it's probably gonna go up after Skyward Sword comes out. <laughs> and then he's just like, ah, it's okay. Um, and then we have an original 3DS, nice and clean. And then we have two 3DS XLs. We have the NES edition and we have the year of the Luigi 30th anniversary edition for this is I think Mario Luigi Dream Team. The Super Nintendo one of this is like stupid expensive still. Um, and then last, the best last thing I think, we have this Game Boy Advance SP. It is a 001, it is not a 101. There is some like scuffing and like scratching on it, especially up on the front, but it is pretty cool. Very cool special edition. Yes. I feel like I'm forgetting stuff. I got stuff for myself from like other places because I did stop at like the Rosebergs, Berg, Roseburg store and I stopped at like a couple other places, but that was it for the store. Oh, we also have a, 160 gig PS Vita memory card as well. 64 gig. 64. Sorry, did I say? You 160? said 160. <laughs> yeah, sorry. It's a 64 gig. We have that as well. Yep. Are you putting the stuff in the system tonight? Yes. All right. So as you guys know, consoles are not sold on the website, so you're not going to be able to get this or the, the handhelds, but the remote, the Amiibo, the games, all that stuff John should be up. was happy about that. He's like, I'm happy that you guys don't sell consoles on the website because this means it's going to stay local and I feel better about selling them. <laughs> I was like, me too. Well, we don't need to go over why we don't ship out consoles again. We've talked about it a million times. I know, but I just... <laughs> but yeah. And then if anybody swoops up this Pokemon Crystal, it is the nicest copy that he had. And it's really nice. Very cool. We do have some more trades to go through, so I'm probably filming that right now. Mm -hmm. This is the rest of the trade-ins from today. So we have Star Wars um, prequel trilogy Blu-ray set. We have Sega Rally Revo? Revo? Never seen that game before. Tiger Woods PGA Tour 2008, Last of Us, Tomb Raider, Far Cry 3, Blazing Angels, Motorstorm, and Buzz. Then we have the Mario and Luigi Super Mario Bros. Edition Amiibo. We have Tarzan Special Edition DVD, Emperor's New Groove. Uh, we have Star Wars New Hope uh, Blu-ray with a steel book. We also have Empire Strikes Back with the steel book. We have the Dark Knight Blu-ray with steel book. And then Batman Begins Blu-ray with Steelbook. So pretty cool stuff. Um, sales were kind of slow today. We also didn't get that many trade-ins, but overall it was pretty good. So I have a couple boxes here of things that I'm getting rid of. Homer. Oh, such a good boy. I'm getting rid of some stuff, taking this to the store. <laughs> he really wants to be on camera. Um, so I've taken some stuff, as you guys know. This box has Intellivision and then 3DOs in the bottom. 
and then this has Odyssey 2, and then a bunch of random stuff. Um, there's like a couple little big planet figures, some like Zelda cards. There's some more down there that are all sealed. Um, there's like a question mark, question block, uh, like light. Um, some random figures and stuff, and then this guy, which the only reason I'm gonna get rid of this is because I already have a complete one. Um, I have a few other graded games that I was thinking about getting rid of, and I'm still planning on getting rid of them, but I don't have opened copies yet, so I'd like to get an open one before I sell them. Um, NFL Blitz Special Edition for N64, uh, Nectaris Military Madness for PS1, and Exertainment Mountain Bike Rally for Super Nintendo. I have those graded to sell, but like I said, I don't have complete copies. So these will be going to the store tomorrow. Doesn't mean they're gonna be in the system tomorrow, but they're at least going tomorrow. So that's going to do it for today's vlog, guys. As you can tell, we are obviously home now. Um, Abby's working on getting downstairs cleaned up a little bit because our friend Nathan is coming on Monday. He's gonna be staying with us for a few days and we're gonna probably do some game hunting um, on, the, on the weekend. I will probably see if Naven wants to come with because um, Naven had planned on going thrifting with me. So obviously we're not gonna be doing that. So maybe he wants to go game hunting, I'm not sure. But uh, yeah, that's gonna be it for today's vlog guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and we'll see you again tomorrow.